हेलो एवरीवन आई एम उदिता चुडासमा फ्रॉम बेट ऑक्सीजन अकेडमी द टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन फॉर दिस वीडियो इज द ट्रबल शूटिंग प्रोसेस इन अ कंप्यूटर नेटवर्क बट फॉर दैट फर्स्ट वी विल डिस्कस द मीनिंग ऑफ द वर्ड ट्रबल शूटिंग एंड देन द ट्रबल शूटिंग ऑफ अ नेटवर्क व्हिच मींस नेटवर्क ट्रबल शूटिंग एंड देन द होल प्रोसेस ऑफ ट्रबल शूटिंग नाउ लेट अस स्टार्ट बाय डिस्कसिंग ऑन what does troubleshooting means now in general terms troubleshooting means to analyze and solve serious problems for a company or an organization troubleshooting is a form of problem solving it is a logical and systematic search for the source of a problem in order to solve that problem usually troubleshooting is applied to something that has suddenly stopped working what is the meaning of troubleshooting in terms of networking that we call as network troubleshooting network troubleshooting is the collective measures that are used to identify diagnose or plan for a solution and resolve those problems and issues within a computer computer network network troubleshooting is a systematic process that aims to solve problems and restore normal network operations within the network network troubleshooting is primarily done by network engineers or the administrators to repair or optimize a network it is generally done to recover and establish network or internet connection on end nodes or devices network troubleshooting can be a manual or automated task we understood the meaning of network troubleshooting and its importance now let us discuss about how to actually apply troubleshooting in a network so we have the network troubleshooting process which consists of five steps these five steps describe the whole process from identifying a problem to finally resolving the problem the first step in network troubleshooting process is defining a problem This step includes describing the problem accurately as the accurate problem definition leads to the accurate problem solution at the end. The second step is the gathering information. In this step the network is scanned to look for a problem or any causes due to which a problem can be occurred in the network. third step consists of analyzing the data by analyzing the data that has been gathered the network administrator needs to come up with a hypothesis of what is actually going on in a network now what is a hypothesis hypothesis is the supposition that is made on the basis of gathered information for having a problem solution fourth step is confirming the result about the problem once the information is gathered and analyzed the network administrator can start finding conclusions also eliminate possible causes and start testing the solutions and then propose the hypothesis of the solution the final step of network troubleshooting process is most important as it includes the documentation part the problem or trouble which is solved should have a complete documentation so that one can refer retain and share the experience in future this video explained about the whole network troubleshooting process but for actually performing this process we need network troubleshooting tools and those tools will be discussed in the upcoming videos so follow bit oxygen academy on instagram and also don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel Bit Oxygen Academy Stay connected to Bit Oxygen Academy and thank you for watching the video